Put and I won't bore you with anything else unless yeah. you want some more wedding facts. No, we're good. I'll you I think you can give no, it to I'm us all set. Yeah, I'm full. Yeah. I'm full. Yeah. I've got yeah. more. I want to make one of those viral videos. I've got more. I'm going down the aisles. Full up. Uh-huh. That'd I'll be cool. Sp- oh, that'd be pretty cool. That'd be real cool. Like, I want to put a mic on Charles to see if he says, like, well, aren't you a peasant surprise? Uh, hey, hey, Kelly? <laughs> Kelly, I want another wedding fact. You want one more? I want one more. One more. Trey. Oh, yeah. Did you know that... Okay, just one more, and then I'll save some more for later. <laughs> Trey with a girlfriend Trey has just, changed so much. Trey just wanted to play this music. <laughs> yeah, found so, it. Megan's going to be carrying a bridal bouquet, as 99.999% of brides do. Yeah. But there is a tradition started by Queen Victoria when she married Prince Albert. She would carry a sprig of myrtle in her bouquet because the myrtle, if you did not know, a is sprig? known as the herb of love. Well, after she got married, she went and planted a myrtle shrub in uh-huh. her garden and every royal bride since that time carries a sprig from that bush in her bouquet. What's a sprig? I don't a know. little, tw- you know, oh, brand, you know sprigs. So that that royal bush that's been there for hundreds of years <laughs> is going to be in. Did you talk about the, the queen like that? What are you talking about? I'm still lost at Prince. Laughing? I'm still lost at Prince Albert because I thought that was a piercing. So she's going to carry the the sprig from that bush in her bouquet, just like every other royal bride has before her. But she doesn't get to keep the bouquet because she's going to go and lay it on the grave of the unknown warrior. Okay. That's what, that's a tradition for royal brides you gotta, too. You gotta spruce up the royal bush, you guys. Yeah, how about the spring? Yeah, Why did you that. not fly me to England to be on TV, it's, it's almost commentating like with like Hoda Cotby? Hoda and I could have had. You could have gone. You could have gone. George oh, would not have. Why didn't we send her? Yeah, Why could... didn't you send me? Um, I don't Do you know, know how long I have to wait for another royal wedding? This is probably it for me for quite some time because I already went through William and Catherine. I didn't get to go to that. Well, here's and now the thing. this. We were gonna send you Kelly. So don't tell me this now. We were gonna send you, but unfortunately, Russ could not find a first class. We <laughs> <laughs> well, found one for him. We yeah, can find one for so, you. So he didn't want you to be upset. Right. So. Why would he care about booking me first class now when he's flown me next to the toilet in the back of the plane on every other flight? He got destroyed on Monday, so he uh, he just wanted. Yeah, to make he sure. accidentally booked it to New London, Connecticut. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, just yanking my chain now. Oh man. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs>